tonight. Maryland went to the Big Ten. Now Towson cuts baseball and soccer. Mm -hmm. The Towson University president announced this move earlier today, citing the familiar reason of long-term financial stability. It's a struggle, but as ABC2 News' Brian Kubler reports, the players feel the university just made an error that cost them the game. If Towson University won't represent them, these players won't represent it. We don't support Towson, so we don't want to wear something that says Towson. Zach Fisher of Perry Hall is just one of the players who blacked out the university's name on their chest as they took the field against Delaware a mere four hours after TU told them they were no longer playing for anything. Baseball and soccer were cut. These ball players now have less to play for than the 2009 Orioles in September. How do you coach a team through a season knowing there's nothing to play for? I don't know. I've never done this before. But, you know, I'll be sensitive to their emotions and we'll just do the best we can and get through it and try to get through it uh, with a certain level of, uh, you know, quality. Mike Gottlieb has been Towson Baseball's head coach since 1988. While he knew this was possible back in the fall, he says he literally got a 30-minute heads up from the administration this morning that the decision was made. After months of considering the option and despite a pretty healthy campaign to prevent it, Towson University, citing long-term financial stability, announced it will slice off two of its teams. In a statement released today, the university president said, quote, It is with confidence but great sadness that I accept the recommendation to discontinue the baseball program at the conclusion of this season and the men's soccer program effective immediately. It's a money issue. Uh, somewhere along the line, uh, keeping track of a budget, got away from some people and here we are and they're saying the budget that's been created lately can't be maintained. Market E administration on your collegiate scorecard, says Gottlieb, a longtime coach now having to work to get all these kids transferred to other baseball programs to say nothing of his own future. Until then, these ball players will play baseball blacking out the name and focusing strictly on the game. I'm gonna play, play like I'm on fire, play angry. You know, I want to prove something. You could use it as a motivation? Yeah, maybe? show them what they shouldn't have done. Starting tonight with Delaware. At Towson University, Brian Kubler, ABC2 News. Now, Towson said it will also reinstate men's tennis. The decision was made after months of studying findings from this task force. The university says it will continue to honor scholarships it gave for both of those sports.